After the disaster of last year Galaxy Note 7, Samsung is looking to redeem itself and the decision to continue with the Note brand is a rather bold one. Will the Galaxy Note 8 be able to rebuild the Note brand in a positive light and regain the trust of Samsung's customers and are there enough improvements to make it a top contender in the second half of 2017's smartphone onslaught? Find out in our full Samsung Galaxy Note 8 review. 1. Design on the exterior The Galaxy Note 8 delivers a very familiar design that we've gotten used to from Samsung over the last couple of years. Glass is the main material of choice filling up the entire front and back and a sturdy metal frame wrapping around the perimeter holds it all together. One thing that you'll notice that is quite different from last year's Note 7 or the more current Galaxy S8 is that the body is much more square and angular. Even the dual curved display is less pronounced this time around. 2. Display the Infinity display that was first introduced with the Galaxy S8 has made its way over to the Note 8. This means super thin bezels on all sides and a screen that takes up almost the entire front. The thinner bezels allow Samsung to fit in the largest screen we've ever seen on a Galaxy Note. Measuring in at 6.3 inches but with an 18.5 to 9 aspect ratio. Despite its height, the Note 8 doesn't feel any less manageable or harder to operate than any other big screen Android phone. The screen is the usual Samsung Super AMOLED technology that brings all the typical characteristics that we've seen on previous Samsung phones such as vibrant colors, high contrast, and inky dark blacks. With a resolution of 2960 by 1440 or 3K QHD+, it's incredibly sharp but in order to enjoy the display to its fullest potential, You'll have to change the display resolution in the settings as the phone defaults to 1080p the same way the Galaxy S8 does. Performance The increase in RAM is definitely a welcome change and it certainly helps the multitasking experience feel much smoother. The Galaxy Note 8 checks all the right boxes in terms of 2017 flagship specs. There's a Snapdragon 835 running the show but this year Samsung has bumped up the RAM to 6GB. It's not the first time we've seen Samsung put 6GB of RAM on a phone but it's the first time that it isn't on a regional exclusive. The increase in RAM is definitely a welcome change especially for a device that's meant to be a productivity or multimedia powerhouse and it certainly helps the multitasking experience feel much smoother. Hardware Obviously we can't talk about the Note 8 without mentioning the S Pen, after all. This is the hallmark feature that defines the Galaxy Note line. The actual hardware of the S Pen itself remains practically identical to last year. It features the same clickable top, a 0.7mm ballpoint sized tip, and over 4000 levels of pressure sensitivity. The major changes to the S Pen are really within the accompanying software features which we will dive into in the software portion of the review. For all you headphone jack lovers out there, you'll be very happy to know that the Note 8 still has one. Camera One of the more drastic changes to the Note 8 this year is the addition of dual cameras on the back. Both sensors feature optical image stabilization, which is a first for any smartphone utilizing dual cameras. Optical image stabilization along with fast dual pixel autofocus, makes it easy to capture photos with tack sharp focus in a reliable fashion. Software, the biggest new S Pen feature is Live Message, which lets you add a little flair to your everyday communication. Pricing and final thoughts when it works, Bixby is fantastic and Samsung has it going in the right direction, but it still needs some polishing. The Note 8 is as exciting a phone as many people, myself included, expected it to be but Samsung might have fizzled out some of that excitement with its hefty price tag. And then positive Samsung Galaxy Note 8 is, premium glass and metal build, gorgeous and large display, improved S Pen features, excellent camera quality, microSD expansion, IP68 certified, fluid performance. And negatives, most expensive Galaxy, note to date, phone is very tall, fingerprint sensor still awkwardly located. Dot.